What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I want to talk about the secret hidden chest on Mercury within the lighthouse and how I believe you will get this thing. But before we go any further people, if you'd like to win some epic loot, simply drop a like on this video, leave a comment down below and join my Discord server, linked within the video description. Okay, so thanks to unknown player for the info. His video which shows this chest can be found linked within the video description if you do want to check that out so basically within the lighthouse on mercury there is a secret chest hidden behind a wall uh, basically underneath where brother vance is which you cannot actually collect at the moment there is obviously a little speculation surrounding this thing and then hinted at this thing on the stream yesterday take a listen um we have this thing we call the forge which we were gonna, we will talk about in a bit, and this is the wall of what are we? This wall of weapons, the Vex weapon wall. Yeah, this 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 actually shows you your progression um, as you're as you're going through, and you're actually building uh, various weapons that are all elective at the end of the game. Okay. Yep. Um, this is an optional end game pursuit yep. that players can enjoy after they finish the campaign. Yep. Mm -hmm. And okay. then we also have a, a mystery that you can solve. Uh, that if you are attentive, you can start to kind of piece together in this space. In this space. In this mm -hmm. space. Okay. So how is this chest unlocked, you are asking? Today I'm gonna to give you guys what in my opinion might happen and how we actually get this thing. So with the Curse of Osiris, after you complete the campaign story missions that come with the DLC, Brother Vance will offer you three verses per week these verses, labelled 1 to 11, each will offer individual weapons which you have to do a certain set of activities to unlock. On the stream we saw a verse, verse 3. With this we had to obtain three things of two different items. Now these items were obtained in their own unique way. One is obtained via doing public events and the other one is obtained by doing either heroic adventures, strikes or the crucible. Once these items were obtained, you activate them in your inventory. The verse or tablet will then be fulfilled by Vance and he basically sends you to the forging machine which is also located in the lighthouse on Mercury. The machine connected to a plaque on the wall is represented by 11 nodes, each represented by a verse, each holding a weapon. These nodes on this wall plaque kind of thing will light up when you activate them and obtain that verse and complete that verse's kind of quest. Like I said, Vance will bring three of these per week. And I think this secret chest will only unlock upon you collecting every weapon these verses offer. This in turn adds to the longevity of this DLC. Within this chest there could be anything, an emblem to say you've basically obtained all weapons or even further an exotic questline which I do hope it is. These verses are truly unique looking weapons. They've even been mistaken by many as exotics, which we now know they ain't. But maybe, just maybe, an exotic may come from the collection of all 11 of these verse weapons. In my opinion, this DLC will withhold at least one exotic back. And that, in my opinion, could come from this secret chest, if this chest is linked to the 11 verses. It means we will at least have to play the game for four weeks to get every verse to unlock this section of Mercury. So it makes sense from a point of view in keeping us and playing the game a little longer. Let's hope that's what it is. Knowing Bungie of late though, maybe you have to run rings around Vance for 20 seconds to jar this war open. The game's become that casual. We will just have to wait and see. But for sure I am hoping if this chest leads to nothing and it isn't opened or collected via collecting all 11 verse weapons, I do truly hope in collecting all 11 verse weapons that at least triggers some kind of quest line to further on the longevity of this DLC. I mean there's gotta be some kind of reward for completing each verse right. That makes serious sense to me and the way Bungie play things out I think it might just happen but what do you think let me know down below but thanks as always for stopping by do hit that like button I do appreciate the support if you're new around here and enjoy daily destiny videos brought to you with an open mind do subscribe and hopefully people i will see you on that next video